I would like to start by reminding everybody how we got to this point. It was about two weeks ago that Councilmember Lololi made his very first federal court appearance after being indicted on 25 counts pertaining to his grocery store businesses. Some of those charges include false immigration documents and obstruction. And tonight, that political expert that I spoke with says he does fully understand why each side is taking their respective stances. Sacramento Mayor Daryl Steinberg using a new tactic today in his efforts to get embattled city council member Sean Lolowi to resign from his District 2 council seat. The wrinkle? Take it public. In a statement that reads in part, Steinberg saying this, While council member Lolowi has the right to due process in a court of law, the fraud and obstruction charges filed against him by the federal government are incompatible with his continued service in public office. Council member Lolowi should put the city first. We have too much important work to do on behalf of the people of Sacramento for more distraction and controversy. Just minutes after that, Lolowi, facing 25 counts on a federal indictment related to his grocery store business, fired back, saying that he will not be resigning, adding in part, quote, the recent challenges that have played out in the media are a misrepresentation of who I am and how I run my business and I vehemently deny any charges. I look forward to my day in court where the truth can be heard. Democratic campaign consultant and Fox 40 political contributor Ed Emerson telling us tonight that he understands the stance the each side today? is taking. First, Mayor Steinberg stands. The mayor's right. I think the mayor is, is good to go in terms of getting out in front of this and respecting the rights of the city, getting taking care of the city's business first. And if you're under indictment, uh, a federal indictment, uh, your time is taken up for the next year, however long it takes for a jury to be selected or if it's a, a, a judge trial, that sort of thing. As for the council member, Emerson also believes his strategy may be effective. You know, Lololi needs to fight. He's a fighter. He's He's been good on... Uh, uh, you know, business. He's a businessman. But right now he's faced with the George Santos defense of all things to have hung around your neck, which is he's indicted but not convicted of anything yet. So do we let the court system play out and then throw him out of office? I think Daryl Steinberg, uh, Mayor Steinberg, saw it differently, and I agree with him in this case. Sacramento City Council will have its next meeting on January 9th, and Lolowi will be back in a federal courtroom in mid-February. And one more note on all of this. The mayor making a point in his statement today to add that because a judge ordered Lolowi to stay at his Granite Bay residence, the mayor wants the city attorney to look into if the council member is still eligible to be on the council because that is where he is currently residing.